Hey, this week I got to experience something that was incredible and beautiful and breathtaking. But I almost missed out on it because I was afraid. I was in the Bahamas and we were, were snorkeling right off the coast of Nassau. And it was incredible. And we go out there and at first I got to admit I was nervous because we take this boat out to the middle of the ocean, the deep blue sea. And, and just the water is incredible. It's blue, it's green, it's just, just technicolor. And it's, it's beautiful stuff. And I, I'm nervous because I'm not that great of a swimmer. I gotta confess, I, I flunked beginning swim lessons like seven years in a row. Seriously, I'm not making that up. It's kind of sad. And, and I just, I don't have any motor skills. I don't have any real aquatic skills. So I was a little scared. I was a little nervous, a little apprehensive. I didn't know if I really even wanted to get off the boat. So we go out there and I'm looking around and it's just water everywhere. And and I've got this snorkel thing that's supposed to protect me and that's about it. And, and so I'm like, <laughs> I don't know. I'm scared. I don't know if I want to do this. I'm really Really nervous. Then I jump in and glub, 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 glub. I go straight to the bottom. And, and then I'm really stressing out and I'm really just freaking out and I'm thrashing around and I'm trying to save myself and I'm trying to, to, to just to tread water and I can't and I'm swallowing just pounds of salt water and it's nasty and I'm just freaking out and I'm like I got to get out of here I got to get out of the water I got to get back on the boat where it's safe where I know I'm going to be okay and I hear this voice just just say just just relax just take it easy just just relax and float. You were built to float, obviously. And so I started to just relax. And I started to float. And I started to look around. And, and I put my little mask on. And I put my little snorkel on. And I put my face in the water. And I'm floating around. And it was amazing. And I saw so much incredible beauty that I would have missed had I not done it. Had I not done Taking the risk, had I not put my face in the water, had I not jumped in, I, and I saw these the coral, and I saw these little fishies, and they were so cute, and it was amazing, and I had to, to just relax, and I had to trust the wave, and I, I just, just, if I fought the wave, because the wave's stronger than me, it, it would have been no good, I would have gone down, it would have gotten ugly, but... I didn't fight the wave. I trusted the wave and I just relaxed and I, I witnessed some serious coral beauty. And I also had to learn to trust the snorkel because I had this, this snorkel and it was my life source. It was my only source of air while I was down underwater. And so I had to learn to trust it, I had to learn how to use it. And, and I got to thinking and I realized the life of faith is a lot like snorkeling in the Bahamas, believe it or not. And, and there are a lot of times when we just need to learn to trust in God. Hebrews 11.1 1 says this, faith is the assurance of things you have hoped for, the absolute conviction that there are realities you've never seen. And it's the same with us. A lot of times we just need to trust. A lot of times we're, we're thrashing around trying to save ourselves. A lot of times we're thrashing around fighting what God is doing in our life. If we just relax and trust him then we're going to witness incredible beauty. We're going to witness incredible things. And we need to learn just to trust the wave. The Holy Spirit is like the wave in our life. He moves us and grooves us and takes us places that we've never been before. But we've got to learn to trust Him. Doesn't mean it's always going to be smooth sailing, because it's not. A lot of times we're going to end up with a face full of just the unexpected. And we're going to end up swallowing salt water. And a lot of times it's going to be scary but we've got to learn to relax we were built to believe we were built for this we were built to lean into someone higher than than us we were built to trust in God and so much of the life of faith is just the falling back into what we can't see and learning to trust and learning to relax and, and not looking at the 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 winds and not looking at, at the storm, but just trusting in God and letting him move us where he, he wants to. God bless you guys. I still got salt water in my ears, but that's okay. I'm, I'm, it's all good. God bless you guys. Giddy up.